First, we should understand the situation uh, clearly. Uh, what has happened is that during the past 10 years, China became uh, tremendously productive and internationally competitive in electric vehicles. Uh, while the United States had one major company, Tesla, uh, which uh, also produced uh, in China, China had hundreds of companies that were really competing against each other and improving the models and driving down costs so that in the Chinese automotive market, the electric vehicles became about 40% of the new vehicle sales. Whereas in the West, uh, the EVs are typically only around 10% or so of new car sales. China outcompeted the United States and Europe. But I think the EU and the US should stop criticizing China. What China did was very good uh, and uh, very proper. It made highly competitive, low cost, high quality electric vehicles. Everything should be done on the basis not of threats and false charges and uh, bad mouthing of China, but rather should be done on the basis of diplomacy and cooperation and the protection which the U.S. and Europe will put on their industry should be temporary and it should be negotiated with China because this protection violates uh, the World Trade Organization principles. And so there should be some proper understanding of this rather than an attempt to make China look like the, the bad player in this. Uh, the bad players are the US and Europe which delayed too long the conversion to electric vehicles.